Harry attended the Super Bowl with Princess Eugenie prompting a flood of reaction from royal fans, including theories about the real reason for Meghan's absence from the key sporting event. The A-lister event was won by the Los Angeles Rams in the early hours of Valentine's Day at SoFi Stadium in Inglewood, California. However, it was the royals that dominated the chatter, with one person suggesting that Meghan let Harry off the leash for the evening and another claiming Meghan had orchestrated her absence to generate a reaction. Taking to Twitter, the woman called Karen, said, Harry at the Super Bowl with Eugenie and not Meghan, was he let off the leash? Is he realizing that life is not what it should be? Unusual to see him without Megs. Whilst the comments that he was let off the leash may be theorizing it is indeed unusual to see Harry without Meghan, it is not as if they do such a big thing without any thoughts behind it. However, some thought there was more to the glaring absence of Harry's wife Meghan Markle. Harry and his cousin at the Super Bowl but not Meghan, what is this? One person tweeted, Harry hates cameras still they went and everybody is like where is Meghan? Another person said that they found it funny that someone who loves the cameras wouldn't show up to the biggest sporting event of the year in the US. According to an expert, Harry's relaxed body language was borderline overkill, Harry's legs play and his almost overkill display of relaxation suggests he's enjoying showing off his new life to his baseball-capped cousin. Body language expert, Judy James told, Meanwhile Eugenie's I smile and rather tentative hand touched to her own legs, suggests she's suitably excited and impressed by the occasion. She continued saying, the Duke of Sussex's body language particularly the roundness of his cheeks suggest he was more excited than his relaxed posture may have conveyed. Harry's wide rounded eyes and the slight rounding of the upper cheek that is visible above the mask suggest he's more delighted than his laid-back body position might suggest. James explained Harry should have been proudly showing so many of his royal relatives around his new home in the US right now, including William and Kate, James said, but instead thanks to rifts, he is seen taking his ever-loyal cousin to the Super Bowl and looking as proud as Punch to do so. The royals did not reveal whether Eugenie is staying with her cousin, wife and two young children at their US home, however while stateside Eugenie may have got to meet baby Lily in person as since her birth last summer the little tot has yet to make a trip to the UK to meet members of the royal family. While it's not clear whether the princess is staying with them while in California, she is the first member of the firm to appear publicly in the country alongside the Duke since the Sussexes moved across the pond. Meanwhile Mickey Guyton the US musician who opened the recent Super Bowl admitted Harry was just lovely, after spending time with him at the showpiece American football game. The Grammy-nominated country star gave a powerful rendition of the U.S. national anthem prior to the Los Angeles Rams' late 23-20 victory over the Cincinnati Bengals, sharing a picture of the pair on Twitter, she wrote I met Prince Harry he was just lovely, I even curtsied in my tracksuit.